This is something very, very specific that I remember using a lot on Twitter, and I'm so happy that Blue Sky has it. So if we go to this page, you'll find the link in the description below. There is all these search terms that you can use on Blue Sky. So let's take a look at some of them because this is pretty cool. You can do a lot, and if you follow me here in the channel for a while, you'll know that I love advanced search syntaxes. So, uh, don't be afraid of that terminology. It's not that hard. If you go to search, you can you can start here too in the search box, but I'm going to this one here because this one is a little bit larger. So the first one, if we use a hashtag here, pan star, and look for that, because you added a hashtag, uh, Blue Sky will show you only the posts with that hashtag. And it looks like I'm the only one talking about this here on Blue Sky. If you haven't, this is yesterday's video. I think you should watch it. Even if you don't plan to buy one of this, this is a pretty cool device. Anyway, let's make this uh, a little... Uh, Pen star is not going to be a good one. Let's try, for example, here, Evernote. Because this is going to show posts from more people. So I have my post, a lot of people talking about Evernote. So this is only the hashtag Evernote. But if we go back here, I can specify a user. So there are many ways to do that. You can say that it's to a user, mentions me from a user. So let's do from me, Evernote, from, from. Vlad Campos. I don't remember if I have to use the, oops, I have to put the column, but I don't remember if I have to use the at symbol. No, I don't. So from, yeah, no at symbol from and just, just, uh, no, yeah, just uh, the person, just uh, without the at symbol. So now all the posts with the hashtag Evernote that are from me. And because I'm the one uh, writing this, I could even write here, instead of using my username, I could write me. Because Blue Sky knows that I am me. <laughs> so that's another option here. Now, there's another one here that is so cool. Uh, oh, you can find domain names too. So, and then this is not the user address. It this are posts. So look at this one here. Uh, all the YouTube posts have this u2.be. So let's try that. Uh, what, what was that domain? Domain column u2. So now it's going to, uh, we're, we're seeing all the posts with the hashtag Evernote from me that also have the, the, the YouTube domain. Isn't that cool? So even this one here, oh, not this one. I want to show you another one that I, I saw. Okay, even this one here, if you look at it, you see this is not correct because there is no YouTube, but there is. This is a link to a YouTube video. Uh, if you look at the bottom of the screen where it's showing the, uh, the mouse hover, you see that this is a YouTube video. So it found any, everything that is from me, that is a YouTube video and that has the Evernote hashtag. And there is even something here that I that is also interesting to uh, help uh, narrow the search. You can use, where is that? Here, since, since or until. So let's do since, since 2024. You have to write the date like this. Let's use this. Uh, December the 1st. Nothing, because I haven't posted anything about Evernote uh, during the last uh, few days. But if we change this here for November, there we have it. So everything, let's go all the way down here. So this is four days ago. November. So all the posts that match this combination has they have to have the Evernote hashtag. They are from me. They have this domain, and they were post uh, posted uh, from the first uh, the first of November. This is so cool. <laughs> I used to use this a lot because 
Every time I uh, I forgot to clip a, a, a tweet in the past, I would have to go uh, search for that tweet so I would know the name of the person or something. And, and you can do that here. You don't have to use the hashtag. You can use just a word without the hashtag. So if you use like this, hello word here, you are looking for, uh, you are searching for this phrase, hello word, uh, no hashtag, just a phrase because you are, you're, you're not adding the hashtag. This site is going to grow a lot and maybe you want to find something from the past and here you have it. Okay, this was very specific, but I think this is an important thing to learn or at least know where you can find the information to, to create the searches. If that was helpful, I'd appreciate a thumbs up. And if you want to help even more, please consider supporting my work on Patreon or YouTube. You can also buy me a coffee. All the links in the description below. Thanks for watching. See you soon.